A man has revealed a surprising way to save money. Living on a cruise ship for 300 days a year can be more affordable than renting a traditional home. Ryan Gutridge spends most of his year aboard Royal Caribbean cruises, embarking on this unique lifestyle. His job allows him to work remotely, which led him to realize that he could work from the cruise ship, potentially making it a cost-effective way to live. Back in 2021, Ryan Gutridge decided to take the plunge and embark on a new life on the seas. He started staying on Royal Caribbean cruise ships after realizing he could do his day job remotely. I think a lot of us assume cruises are for retired people who can leave home for long periods of time due to a lack of commitments, he said. However, Gutridge sees it as a cost-effective way of living if you can work while away. He told local news, I work in IT as an engineer specializing in cloud solutions for a leading provider, and I have been working remotely since 2012. But because of the pandemic, my team was able to work from home and access the data they needed from anywhere. At that time, cruise lines hadn't announced when or if they were coming back. I thought that if they returned, I'd want to try taking my job with me on a short cruise. I wanted to see how the Wi-Fi would work and if I could access some elements of my job with heavy security. He has visited Coco Cay and Nassau in the Bahamas over 70 times each in the past two years. The ship he boards embarks on the same route twice a week, with both destinations being part of the itinerary. While he mainly chooses to sail on the same ship, he has also experienced voyages on larger vessels. During his cruises, he engages in meetings in the mornings and afternoons. However, he also takes the opportunity to have lunch, socialize, or meet people at the gym. In fact, he has formed connections with individuals whom he stays in contact with and who have joined him on multiple cruises aboard the same ship. Having previously experienced isolation while working from home, he found that cruising has had a significant impact on his social life. Not having children or pets made it easier for him to become somewhat introverted, but cruising has helped him break out of that shell and become much more social. In the summer of 2021, Gutridge booked two four-night cruises on Royal Caribbean's Freedom of the Seas. Everything worked great, and since then, I've been on a cruise pretty much every week, except for a few weeks due to the holidays, he said. Gutridge had to crunch the numbers before embarking on his new life, something that involved a lot of research. While crunching the numbers, he realized that the cost of living at sea for 300 nights as almost neck and neck with what he was paying for his apartment and trash service. But with the cruise comes added perks like free Wi-Fi and free drinks, meaning he's also saving money on other bills and expenses. After all, anyone who works from home will know the pain of having internet issues and forking out for overpriced Wi-Fi, so the deal here sounds like a pretty sweet one in that sense alone. I wanted to really look at the cost of cruising full-time before I began, Gutridge continued. I have a spreadsheet that automatically records all my expenses, which helps. I also establish a budget annually. For this year, my allocated budget for base fare is approximately $30,000. When I began closely examining the numbers last year and assessing the amount I spent on base fare for 300 nights on board a ship, I discovered it was nearly on par with what I paid for rent and trash service for an apartment in Fort Lauderdale, Florida. He continued, My drinks and internet are free. If people are going to do something like what I do, I recommend trying different brands because they all offer something different. But once you commit to one, you should stick to it so you reach those loyalty levels. I found that Royal Caribbean has by far the most valuable benefits to me. Discounts, free internet, and free drinks," Gutridge concluded. What are your thoughts on this non-traditional way of living? Let us know in the comments, and don't forget to subscribe for more. Until next time, take care.